Let's go through how to set up your device to accurately track barbell velocity using the metric app. Open the app and start a new workout, either blank or from a template. Add a set and enter your weight. For coaches, enable coach mode in the account menu and add your athlete to the session before recording. Metric tracks barbell lifts done with circular weight plates. By default, it is calibrated for regulation 45 centimeter sized plates. If you are lifting with standard plates, tap the camera button to open your camera. For all other plate sizes, long press the camera button and enter the plate diameter in the setup menu. Your device needs to be stationary when recording. Handheld footage will be inaccurate. We recommend using a portable mini tripod for getting the best framing on your lifts, although you can also use a water bottle or kettlebell to stabilize your phone. Place your phone roughly side onto the barbell between zero and 30 degrees. Frame your video so the lifter and plates stay visible throughout the set, including the unrack and re-rack. Use the phone zoom or reposition your tripod as needed. For exercises below waist height, like deadlifts, place the device on the floor. For lifts like squats, cleans, and bench presses, raise the device to waist height, while for overhead moves, like presses and snatches, bring the phone up to shoulder height for best results. Having bright lights shining directly into the camera lens near the moving barbell can interfere with tracking. Adjust your framing to keep these bright lights to a minimum. Once you're happy with your device position, hit record and complete your set. When you finish, tap the stop button or the timer to end the recording. You can now review your velocity, tempo, power, range of motion, and play back the video with bar path all from within the app. Metric also has advanced camera mode settings for higher precision on lifts faster than one meter per second mean velocity, like cleans and snatches. This advanced mode is not effective in darker environments, so be sure to only use it in well-lit settings. Follow these guidelines and you'll reliably get great data to help with your training in the Metric app. Now time to go lift some heavy weights.